Hi YouTubers, welcome back to Queen's um, YouTube channel. How are you doing? Today I want to share something with you guys. How to save money on wraps, uh, do-rags for us, the way we would like to wrap our hair up. You know, whether you have straight hair, locks, or sister twists. Today the world is getting too expensive to run out there and to buy things that you can make in your own home. We have to start looking at the bigger picture. So at this time, I'm going to show you guys how to make bonnets, which is pretty much considered lock socks, socks locks, however you want to call it, uh, which is this is one of my bonnets right here. You know, just say for instance, you have to run out the house fast enough. You don't need to really comb your hair. Your bun can be as messy as you want it to be. All you want to do is have something to put on your head to look decent which this is healthy for your hair. It can breathe, you can dress it up, or you can dress it down. You can take a look at my bonnet from the back to the front, and it's very, very comfortable. You can pull it up higher or back. I like mine to stay back some. So getting started today, I want to say my clients and whoever else out there is into saving money. There are so many ways you do not have to go out that door and spend money that you need for your kids or rent or just for food. So here on out, I will be trying to share tips instead of just talking about my hair care and growing hair. Which this fit in with growing hair as well because if you're in the process of growing your hair and you're tired of the itchy wigs, you can go into making yourself a, a lock sock which is very easy without walking out your door spending one dime. So with that being said, let's get started. Today, this is a bunny lock sock that I made personally. With that being said, I'm sure you can see at the bottom, I got the lock sock on with my stretch shorts on, which all came as one. So we're gonna get started today. Pants in your house that you have not wore for at least a year. You're just looking at them. You have them locked in the closet, the garage. These are stretch pants that I basically have had over two years. Nice, but I have not worn them. So the material is very flexible, thin, good material. So I'm going to go ahead and make me a lock sock. On top of that, it's hot. It's summertime. So I also don't want to go out and buy me any shorts. So at the same time, I'm going to have a pair of shorts with the lock socks that match it, which will make it look very, very nice. Again, take any stretch pants, even if they're not elasticity, you can have the cotton stretch pants as well. Take them. All you need is a pair of scissors. Getting started. You want to take them, fold them in half. It depends how short you want your shorts to be. So I'm going to start just right in the middle. This is going to be my lock sock. You take your shears and you just proceed to start cutting right across. You don't have to be neat about it. Just cut it. Within five minutes, you have saved yourself anywhere from 10 to $20. Why? Because now you have your stretch pants you can put on. If they're too long for you, cut them some more. You can stay cool in the summer. I haven't bought nothing now. I have a pair of stretch pants to wear, which is great. I will be wearing them tomorrow. On my next video, I will show you five different ways of styling your hair in the lock sock that costs you nothing but what's in your house. Okay, to my clients, we now have our lock sock. It comes with two of them. So what I like to do for those who I notice in need, that's my client, especially those who wear wigs, who's tired of wigs, I show them how to put on nice earrings, do their eyebrows, maybe a little eyelashes, and put it on the lock sock. You do not have to have hair to wear one of these. You do not have to have dreads to wear one of these. You do not have to have straight hair to wear one of these. Anyone can wear a lock sock. 
So if I have two of them, I'm going to share with someone that I want to share with and show them how to apply it on. Now I know I already have on one. I'm just going to double this up on this. So again, like I said, with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the lock sock that we made today, which cost us nothing, okay? Yeah, I get really excited when I can save money. So again, this is so cool because it can stretch any way that you want it to stretch. So if your hair, your dress is like all the way to your ankle, it's going to be perfect. If they, you're just starting out, it's still going to be perfect. It doesn't matter. Again. So, I'm just going to double this up like I had said and put in my new lock sock on. Remember, it's a stitch in the back. You can't see it, but you want the stitch to stay in the back of your head so everything can be even. You basically just roll it. You put it over your bun, which I'm going to put it over my bun. Like I say, when you have somewhere to go and you're trying to move quick, just get your lock sock. Some people like to pull them up. I like mine to slide back. It's up to you. This one is up over my forehead, which is fine because I just want you guys to get an idea of how cute it is and what it looks like. You can look at this. It costs me absolutely nothing. It's a bun. Every time I go out, people ask me, where do you buy your material at? What store, what craft store you go to? You know. I don't hold back, I just give them the tips. 9 out of 10, they give me their own stretch pants and want me to make it for them really quick. Even sometimes you have stretch pants that match and they come with a shirt. Imagine this, you have on your bunnick, your nice shorts for the summer, and the shirt that match, whether it's long or short. That's a whole outfit that you did not have to walk in the store and save. So ladies and guys, Stop throwing away your clothes. Take a second look at them. And remember, it's always something that you can do to them. Whether they're jeans or regular shirt. This shirt can be cut to a whole different style. Life is too expensive to be throwing away money. So again, if you enjoy my lock sock, come back and visit me. I will show you five different ways to wear your lock sock to have fun with them. Again, you can dress it up or you can dress it down and you can match. If you don't want to match, don't worry about it. And at the same time, while you have on one lock sock, you can give a gift to another person. There were locks, sister locks, twists, braids, or just straight hair or no hair. Why not give a gift so it can come back in a circle? Thank you for choosing Queen's Natural Hair Care. If you like this video, prescribe, and I'll be back with more information on how to save money on your lock sock and more. Thank you.